Hi everyone, and welcome to another episode of Square One Minecraft Survival. Now, today, I'm gonna start working on my castle a bit. And I'm just going to continue on this little entrance area I have. I have no idea yet what to make of it, but I guess we will figure out soon enough. So bear with me and let's get cooking. First I need to get me some materials. Now last time I used all the stone brick I had. So yeah, we will just have to make ourselves some new stone brick. Let's see, I have plenty of cobble. And some stone and some stone brick, so that's good. Um, and let's get some cooking. Let's grab some cobble, this iron I don't need. So yeah, let's get that cooking and I'll see you in a bit when I have my materials fixed. And we're back with some stone and some, yeah, some stone. <laughs> so let's see, it's snowing and um, yeah, like I said, I'm not really sure how I should do this, but I think I will make some stairs going up to the living quarters and I make them out of stone slabs maybe and I need some stone bricks some stone brick stairs and maybe I should cook another stack just so we have more when we come back Yeah, I, I blocked off the, <laughs> the door to my house, so zombies can't um, break it while I'm gone. This is what I like about the, the whole ice biomes. It snows and it doesn't rain, so that's awesome. It doesn't make sound and it looks pretty. And I don't mind the snow laying around everywhere. It just, yeah, I really like it. So let's see. I think I will do some uh, foundations here first. We will have an entrance gate around, yeah, right here. Mm, so let's see. I'm, I really don't know. how I should do this let's just lay out the floor plan first so one two three four five six seven I think would be enough So yeah, that's one tower and one tower on this side. Let's see. Right there. Two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now let's fix this. Never have dirt underneath your built that just looks really bad so yeah 
these are the towers oh it stops snowing and it's getting night <laughs> Uh, so I better head back real quick, get some sleep, and let's see, yeah you can't really see anything but I think this will look okay. I haven't decided yet on the materials I will use, though. Um, so I think I... I We'll think about that some more in a late for a later episode. So today I'm going to work mostly with cobble and stone bricks. So let's head back. Continue. This here is just awful. <laughs> um, right, uh, I think I will go excavate some of this, make it flat. So we can have a nice little courtyard before the stairs that go uh, all the way up to the top of the hill. So yeah guys, what materials should I use? Let me know. I personally really like well, everything, <laughs> as long as you use them in the correct way. There's certain materials that go really well together, and um, some just really don't. And um, on the previous castle, Neu Schwanstein, I, I probably should go on. Um, on the old world and check that out the, that castle because it's yeah it's a bit dated for my for the the stuff that I built now nowadays but it's still it's very awesome and um yeah I, I think you should see it and on that project I mostly used snow as uh, the materials for the walls and stuff which was uh, also in a snowy biome, so snow was also very plentiful, but the problem with snow is that um, to make, or, or in that castle anyway, it, the problem was that I used quartz for uh, all the detailing in the windows, and there were quite a few windows, and I had to get quartz all over the nether. <laughs> which wasn't uh, which was qu quite a pain to do so I'm not sure if I want to use snow on this building other materials that go really well together are uh, bricks and a sandstone or bricks in general but with, with stone bricks as well um, so that's that's cool and I think uh, to get stone bricks oh, or as uh, normal bricks uh, it, it isn't um, as much of a hassle as uh, quartz but we have have to go and go some questing to get some because um, it, it isn't it is it's quite rare rare in the map and um, now that the gen generation of um, oceans has changed quite a lot, you yeah, now have a lot of deep oceans, which just have gravel on the bottom. So 
there's also less bricks or clay on the bottom of seas so that's maybe also a bit of a problem but anyway let's just continue on this building one two three four five six seven so that's nice this is one tower and the other tower one two three four five six seven Also, this tower could function as some kind of stairs going up to the to the hill as well. So you can actually reach all parts of the castle from from the insides. This will be pretty awesome. Oh yeah, and shouldn't forget that I'm in survival. Um, I actually have been working on, on some other projects uh, over on the Square One Skyblock server. I can't really say what it is, but um, I have been building a lot lately there. And I'm dying to, to let you guys know what it is. But, um, yeah, I guess I'll just have to wait until the release. But I can assure you, it will be pretty awesome. Uh, so this will be an archway. And um, we'll have a gate over here. Maybe I can, uh, oops, maybe I can make a piston gate out of it. On my very first castle I actually made uh, also a, a castle gate, uh, which I got from a, a YouTube video as well, but I rigged it up on a code lock so you actually have to had to know the code to to get on uh, to get inside the castle and the cool thing is that I it took me quite some time to invent the, the redstone for the code lock but the, the cool thing is that it was reprogrammable so if, if too many people figured out the code, you could just head into the secret redstone compartment thing and uh, adjust the code, make a new one. And if you actually type in the wrong code, <laughs> um, a trapdoor would open and you got... <laughs> you you fell into the sewer so that's that was a nice gimmick i made i made in that Isn't that starting to look nice? I won't be doing this as detailed as um, I would do it in creative though because uh, that would just take too much time I guess and um, 
I also find it quite hard to to talk to you and uh, build at the same time so yeah I haven't done much really and it's already it's, it's getting late already so yeah oops anyhow um, probably this will I will make this part a bit wider two three four five six seven and right here will be the end of the the gatehouse. Like so. Yeah, I probably should go back before the mobs <laughs> track me down. Also guys, what I, what I do like to know is, I'm, I'm building this castle now, but uh, what do you like to see me do? I really wonder what, what, what's, what is nice to see. Do you like uh, building, do you like questing? Just let me know. And um, yeah, if, if, if I like the idea, then I will certainly be doing that. Maybe I could start adding some details already on this. Um, let's place that back. Like some reinforcements for the walls. And also on this. It's all nice and cobbly, but let's add some detail already. Like on the if you look at um, at castles and on other um, stony all all stony buildings, you always see these on the edges. They have these corner stones, so that's what this is. And uh, I guess I'm I'm not really sure what their function is. I guess it's yeah, some kind of reinforcing, probably. And I also I think it does add some detail to the to the castle. So I 
I always try to avoid um, having two large surfaces from one material only. I'm just building along at this at this point, just trying out stuff. Most times I, I just end up liking what I do and most of the times I hardly change the design of what, what I'm doing. But maybe at a later point when this is all starting to get shapes uh, I might change some, some stuff I don't know we'll see so yeah that's the gatehouse probably there will be also something here maybe like so to give it some more body And after this I see we are getting to the slope already. What I actually want is uh, just a little courtyard thing and the windy stairs going up on both sides. But first on that side because my first main part of this castle will be on that side. Um, besides that it looks nice I also wanted to have some uh, some function so it will be my main base so I also need a storage space somewhere which isn't <laughs> as unorganized as the stuff I have now and uh, maybe I the enchanting room I will uh, relocate it to there and and stuff like that I actually never brew potions, so um, I don't know how that works. I really never use any potions, um, but I probably will, probably will have a potion room as well, just for for the case that I will use a potion. Then, yeah then I at least I can brew some ah, that, didn't, that didn't work oh well let's see let's build this arch
I think I want a more rounded arch with stairs. Like so. So there's also on this side. Perfect. Let's make this thing this side the same. And I think the foundations of my gatehouse are done. Yep, this looks good. Let me add some more detailing here. So yeah, this is basically my gatehouse. Just have to build it up. Add another floor, and it's getting night again, I see. And I think having this done, which is already coming together quite nicely, I will end this episode, and I will see you guys next time. Probably because I have to go and scavenge some materials I will be doing some showcases instead because also guys I really want to show you what I have done in the past and let me know what you think of it I would really like to know so yeah I will show you that maybe later this week and I will continue and get some materials for this I will search for some bricks, sandstone, and I will gather a lot of wood, I, I guess. So we have plenty of materials to work with when we are done, when we are continuing this. So yeah, see you guys next time.